going on everybody we are back on the youtube channel with another video and this one y'all is going to excite y'all because we are in a prime location on the northeast side of san antonio and as you can see a lot of people that see youtube videos are relocating here to san antonio and i know y'all look for a dream home um, where it's on more land so this community is uh, going to be on half an acre out here and as you can see it has nothing but mature trees out here it is beautiful very elegant you get these nice finishes this builder is going to be called chesmar um, chesmar is a very very high-end builder that builds in a lot of different areas around san antonio texas and uh, over here like i said we're going to be more uh, north uh, higher north but northeast is what i like to say uh, is where it's at um, as you can see, when you start tapping into half an acre lots or more, you tend to get a sideways, uh, side entry garage is what I should say. Um, a lot of people look for that, especially when they're building their dream home. They don't like to have the garage in the front of the house. They want it to be more unique, more ideal. And this is very, very unique. Uh, just having the uh, garage on the side of the house rather than the front. And like I said, you can only do those when you have half an acre or more. So this uh, community is only going to have 69 different uh, lots available. There's already 14 of them sold. So there's only a few of them left. There is a couple lots that are oversized that are all at almost an acre, which is very, very nice uh, for this builder in this community because you might be one of the first ones to get almost an acre lot in this community and you'll have a lot of privacy and a lot of quiet space where you won't see your neighbors. Again, there's a lot of lots out here with just a bunch of trees where you won't see anybody if you're one of those people that uh, just likes to be very secluded. Uh, but as you can see, you have this front porch area before we walk into your friend's doorways. Uh, you have this beautiful, beautiful front porch uh, with limestone and stucco. Uh, it's very huge, a very nice sitting area. This house specifically is going to go for like 1.2 million if it did sold because uh, this is the model home. And then usually with model homes, you're going to have all the upgrades. Uh, but as soon as you come in, you're going to have your grand foyer. Very beautiful upgraded light fixtures. You have the wooden beams on top, very nice architecture design. Um, then you're gonna have your flex room slash office area where you can come in and do some work. Um, whatever you wanna make this little area, I'd personally make it a study. And then, yes, we can go this way to the living room area, but we're gonna come through here because I do like these double doors that lead to your kitchen and your living room area slash dining room area as well. You have this huge breakfast area is what I like to call it or butcher's kitchen. But then you also have this L-shaped countertops and this over here that you can make that as well. You have this black cabinetry, 42 inch cabinet. Uh, you are gonna get the glass cabinetry at the top with the crown molding, vented, uh, cook top hood right there. You have a gas community as well. This is an upgraded stove. It has six burners. Uh, you are going to get the farm style sink, black faucets. You are going to get stainless steel appliance, appliances such as your dishwasher, oven, uh, microwave, and again, once again, the gas cooktop and your fridge right here. Over here, you're going to get the utility room right over here very very nice very spacious utility room you're gonna get your mud room right here you're gonna get a guest or powder bathroom right over here and then you're gonna get another bedroom over here this is a four bed three and a half bath and just take a look at these floors honeycomb floors very very nice this very nice, unique countertop right here. You get a walk-in shower. And then you get a little bathroom right here as well. Or I'm sorry, your closet. So you get a lot of space in this house. 
This is about 3,200 square feet of open houses. And this is uh, the high voltage ceilings with the cedar planks at the very top. Upgraded, upgraded light fixtures once again. You have a formal dining room over here. Again, with the wooden beams. And guys, this home is gonna consist of all tile. The only thing it's not gonna have where the tile is gonna be at is a couple bedrooms. In the secondary bedrooms, you'll have carpet. Everything else though, for the most part, is going to have tile, which is very nice. When you come out here to the backyard, you're gonna have this nice uh, stucco on the, ver on the very bottom of the floor. You get a nice sitting area right here. You put a TV, another fireplace. Uh, this is a gas community. Once again, you got a built-in barbecue grill with a mini fridge over there. And then over here, you have another sitting room area, two double doors, and we'll get to that in here in a second. And then you have a view of your backyard, again on half an acre, very spacious and a walking trail. If you wanted to put another sitting room area or a uh, fire, pit or you know whatever you want to have out here um, you are going to have septic oh, right over there and as we come back in i like how they put mirrors right here opens up the room it's still 3200 square feet very huge very spacious you get a nice limestone fireplace from floor to the ceiling they already have the tv intact Right over here, you're gonna get the master bedroom. You're gonna get a nice little breakfast area right here to make your coffee. I love they, the, how they did that. As Soon as you wake up, boom, fire up the coffee. You get this nice brick backsplash. And then you get these huge double paned windows with another view of your backyard. And then right over here, you're gonna get two French doorways leading into your ensuite and you're gonna get porcelain floors. One of these little rooms to our right is gonna be the throne to get all your business done. Keep all that nasty, uh, nastiness of the rest of the bathroom and the fumes. And then you get a linen closet. Here you're gonna have his and her sinks, quartz countertops. Of course, this one's the wifey's right here because you're gonna get a vanity so she can do her makeup. You get the nice black accent around the mirror and then I like how they added a window at the top to bring in some natural lighting. You get a nice upgraded light fixture right here. It is gonna be intact with surround sound. That is an upgrade for music and stuff. You get this huge walk-in shower with the porcelain backsplash. Of course, this isn't porcelain. This is a different regular towel as well as this size, but that backsplash is gonna match your floors. You get the honeycomb flooring at the bottom separated garden tub and then right over here you have a walk-in closet that is just huge with a window of the front door or the front yard i should say but this is more than enough room for husband and wife very spacious one more look at the master And then as we come over here, we're gonna go and head to the secondary bedrooms. Here is the secondary bedrooms. First room to our left is gonna have the game room. I love the feel in here. It feels like a movie room if you wanted to make it, right? You get two huge windows, floor to ceiling once again. And then here are those double doors I was talking about leading into your backyard so you have two different entryways you can get to your backyard i love that and then as you come over here you're gonna have two secondary bedrooms you're gonna have a closet right here just for some extra storage space you're gonna get a nice secondary bedroom in here nice accent wall walk-in closet to our right but this is very spacious and there's no door leading into your bathroom I kind of like that it leaves it more open more appealing you do get tile right here 
Of course, they're not going to have carpet in the bathroom, but you do get carpet in the bedroom. And then another window to your backyard. This is going to be your Jack and Jill concept theme right here because you have the shower and tub combination. Another little linen closet. And then leading into the other bedroom once again. Here's that walk in closet for them. They're pretty spacious closet, pretty spacious bedrooms. I do like that. It doesn't feel small at all. This room is going to have a view of your front yard. And then we are back to the hallway. But, but guys, that will conclude our tour for today. This home again is 1.2 million, but this community is going to start at 840,000 with their smallest home being at 2,500 square feet. It can go all the way up to 3,800 square feet. So this home and this builder has a lot to offer. This is a semi custom builder is what I like to call it because you could do a lot of upgrades and there's a lot of floor plans you could choose from and make a couple changes. But y'all that will conclude it once again. And until next time, I'll see you on the channel. And if you're looking to get started or looking to relocate to San Antonio, Texas, comment down below or text me the word home. Thank you.